Okay, let's take a look at the uh, preposition met. Met is very easy to use. It means with. Uh, it could also be by in certain cases. Um, and in the same way that we would use uh, by and with to talk about some sort of means. So, for example, we could say by bus or with a Greyhound bus. So, these, this is going to use the same set of pronouns that we saw in ya and apo, for and from. So let's take a look at the list on the left, and the epsilon that's parenthetical is uh, because it's just a little too difficult to say epsilon and then epsilon again. For with me, we'd have to say me, mena, and Greek doesn't like to do that. Greek, Greek likes to have a vowel, consonant, vowel, consonant pattern where possible. So we will cut one of the epsilons and we'll get me, mena. Now that could really happen in most uh, situations where you've got one vowel tied to another. Um, I've just presented here some of the most common forms, but you'll probably wind up cutting one of the vowel sounds like where it says with her, maftin, you may wind up saying maftin, and the epsilon will disappear. There's a different set of rules uh, for things like that. And uh, reading from top to bottom, we have memena, mesena, mafton, Meftin, mefto, memas, mesas, meftus, meftes, mefta. And if we're going to mention a person and not a pronoun, we'll use meton plus whoever the male is and metin. Ime me aftin. Ime me sas. Ime me tombaba. Ime me tiniki. Ime meton Andrea. Ime me aftes. Ime metin dieya. Ime mesena. Then he may have done. Then he may have done. Now these are not only used uh, for people. We can use them for many other things as well. Just like in English, the way we use with mezahari. Me alati, me piperi, me domata, me salsa, me meli, me gala, me rigani, me vutiro, me kima, me siropi, me tiri, me piperoriza, me lemoni. Me guía, me agapi, me enajamogelo, me jara, me zaros. Me hipomoni, me entusiasmo, me treno, 
με λεωφορείο, με ταξί, με τα πόδια, με πιστοτική κάρτα, με χρεωστική κάρτα, με μετρητά, με ευρώ, με δολάρια. Τέλος! Με αγάπη και με εκτίμηση ο δάσκαλος.